At 9 o'clock, second 9 o'clock game of Friday, we got Syracuse, who's 3-1. and one. Trevor, number 25, UNLV, who's 4-0. and oh. UNLV favored by 6.5 points on FS1. Kyle McCord has gone 114-177, thrown for 1,459 yards, 14 touchdowns, 5 interceptions. LaQuint Allen's had 54 carries for 287 yards and a touchdown. Trevor Penna has had 20 catches for 316 yards and 5 touchdowns. Matthew Sluka, I know, um, has gone 21-48, thrown for 318 yards, 6 touchdowns, 1 interception. Also leads his team on the ground with 39 carries for 253 yards and a touchdown. Ricky White the third has had 20 catches for 253 yards and 5 touchdowns. These two teams have never played against each other. Um, so this is, this is a big game for both football teams, right? Syracuse is coming off an easy win against Holy Cross. They got right after losing to Stanford a couple weeks ago, right? This was a big get-right moment for Syracuse, right? It was great. They're playing a really tough team on the road. They're going to go on the road against a top 25 UNLV squad. And this is a chance to prove if you're Syracuse, right? You lost that game to Stanford. That was a heartbreaking way to lose a football game. You you could easily be 4-0 and right now. But you go on the road and you win this game, you're 4-1. and Suddenly you move up into that second tier, in my opinion. You move into the Boston Colleges of the world. You move into the Louisvilles of the world. Where it's like, sure, you're not Miami or Clemson, but you're definitely somewhat of a threat to win the ACC. So... That's a big. This is a big game for Syracuse. Combo Court's been playing really well. UNLV really proved something to me last week. UNLV had a crazy game, all things considered, right? Um, you lose your starting quarterback, who's not only your leading passer, by the way, still is, and your leading rusher, by the way, still is, after that week. It, it, it looked like you were playing a good Fresno State team. I picked UNLV to lose that football game. I thought Fresno State was going to win. UNLV kicked the ever-living crap out of Fresno State. Um, and while it's Fresno State, this is a much different level of competition with Syracuse. I really respect that UNLV was able to bounce back like that after it looked like they weren't gonna, they weren't going to, right? They looked like they we're gonna lose. This is, by the way, I think number one, the most important game on Friday night, um, but also the most interesting. Uh, just like straight up, should be the best game. Two really good football, two pretty solid football teams playing against each other. Um, I think Syracuse is pretty good. I think UNLV is pretty good. I think this is a big game for group of five consideration because, remember, I think if UNLV wins out, they're the favorite to make the playoffs, right? A loss here would be massive for a team like James Madison, for a team like Liberty, uh, looking for teams like Navy and Army. This could be big if Syracuse could win this football game. I honestly think they do. I really believe in Kyle McCord. He's been cooking recently, and I like Kyle McCord a lot. Uh, give me Syracuse to actually go on the road and pull off this upset on Friday night.